You're watching PTV. Encore Energy Corp, America's clean energy company, is now providing the necessary domestic fuel for clean, affordable nuclear energy. With their Altamesa in situ recovery uranium processing plant in Texas, now in production, the company is the only uranium producer in the United States with multiple operational uranium processing plants. Alta Mesa, along with Rosita, Encore's other operating plant, now gives the company a reliable supply of uranium and a distinct competitive advantage. Alta Mesa will be ramping up to the complete plant capacity, that is one and a half million pounds a year with direct trunk line feed, as well as an additional half million pound of drying capacity that will be uh, utilized with remote ion exchange plants, very similar to the type that we're using on well fields at uh, Rosita. Encore managed to advance the Alta Mesa project from acquisition to production in just 15 months, thanks largely to the proven, economical and environmentally responsible in-situ extraction process, with the added advantage of being in Texas a business-friendly, pro-energy agreement state. By in-situ, we have a much shorter permitting time, we have a much shorter construction time, much smaller capex, much smaller opex, most importantly, perhaps a, a much, much smaller reclamation cost once we're finished with an area. But the launch of Encore's Alta Mesa facility is only the tip of the iceberg for a company that's on the move. By virtue of being debt free and then adding two sources of revenue, we're able to advance all of our assets uh, destined for production across the entire spectrum. We're working uh, to drill rapidly in uh, Texas at uh, the next project for the Rosita plant, that being Upper Spring Creek. We're also uh, quite active in uh, the Wyoming-South Dakota border with our Dewey and Dewey Burdock Terrace projects, uh, as well as uh, moving gas hills along and uh, perhaps most importantly drilling out uh, much more of the uh, undeveloped, unexplored areas on the Alta Mesa track itself so that we can reach uh, maximum production capacity there and, and even potentially someday look to expand that. This kind of momentum has Encore thinking big. When Encore looks at growth, we're looking at it from two angles. One is uh, generic growth, that is internally, how fast we can take our current package and move it forward. And that's limited largely to availability of drill rigs, quite frankly, both in the exploration side, the development side, and of course, where we really concentrate with our very advanced assets, the production side. When we look outside of the company for growth potential, it's, it's obviously gonna be focused on M&A. And uh, that simply is uh, a function of valuation. With our current balance sheet and revenue, we think those will uh, potentially materialize over the next year. Encore has a pipeline of production-focused projects to realize its growth aspirations. We do have a number of uh, significant projects, most notably uh, the Dewey Project in South Dakota and Wyoming, which is uh, probably pushing 20 million pounds. Number one project in our pipeline is expansion of Alta Mesa. It's already in production, sitting in the midst of an 80,000 hectare project with uh, a number of known uranium occurrences, a well-documented roll front system extending over 50 miles, and very little of that has actually been uh, fully explored or uh, drilled to uh, resource definition. So our number one project is our current number one project. Encore Energy is producing domestic uranium to fuel nuclear energy and reducing reliance on foreign suppliers in the United States, placing the company in a leadership position.